Hi, Brent Tech here, where tech is made simple. So just a quick video to let you know that if you're using Google Gemini, that Gemini finally now supports audio uploads on the web, iOS and Android, which according to Google and the announcement for this new update has been a number one request. So it's been a highly requested feature. Now, how this will all work is on the web, you would select and click on the Add Files button. And then you would click on Upload Files. And for mobile, that would be just called Files. And I'm going to include this MP3 sample file and open. And the audio file can be in popular formats like MP3, WAV, M4A, and so on. So basically, if you want to transcribe audio and expand the file analysis options, then this is a nice move in the right direction. Now, before we transcribe that MP3, just to give you an idea as to what it actually sounds like before Gemini takes a look and transcribes that for us. Okay, so you get the general idea. Now I'm going to just head into the chat box and just say transcribe. That'll take a second or two to generate. And there we go. The audio file is a tone that sounds a bit like an old fashioned emergency broadcast or a telephone busy signal with an escalating and de-escalating pitch. It's a synthetic sound, not a voice or a musical instrument. So there you go. That's just transcribing that MP3 file for me. And very useful for transcribing audio, which, as mentioned, has been a highly requested feature and is now finally available in Google Gemini on the web and on mobile. Now, just a quick heads up that Google says the total audio length can be up to 10 minutes for free users, while it's three hours for Google AR Pro or Google AR Ultra subscribers. So just keep that in mind if you are going to use this feature. And if you are using Gemini, I do think that this is a nice move in the right direction. So thanks for watching and I'll see you in the next one.